The Little Book of Common Sense Investing by John C. Bogle is a personal finance and investment book that was first published in 2007. The book is a guide to low-cost, passive investing that emphasizes the importance of avoiding investment fees, diversification, and a long-term investment strategy. The author argues that active investment strategies, which rely on stock picking, market timing, and other forms of market speculation, are likely to underperform passive investment strategies, which simply track the market as a whole. He encourages readers to invest in low-cost index funds, which provide broad market exposure and minimize investment fees. The author also stresses the importance of avoiding debt and maintaining a disciplined, long-term investment strategy. He argues that investment success is not about making a few large, speculative bets, but about consistently and systematically investing in the market over time. The book is written in a straightforward, accessible style and is intended for a general audience of individual investors. It provides a simple, common-sense approach to investing that emphasizes the importance of avoiding investment fees, diversifying one's portfolio, and maintaining a long-term investment strategy. Overall, The Little Book of Common Sense Investing is a classic investment guide that offers practical, actionable advice for individual investors who want to build wealth and achieve financial independence. The Little Book of Common Sense Investing offers several important money lessons, including Avoid investment fees. High investment fees can erode investment returns over time, making it more difficult to achieve financial goals. The book emphasizes the importance of investing in low-cost index funds, which minimize investment fees and provide broad market exposure. Diversify your portfolio. Diversification is a key aspect of a successful investment strategy. The book encourages readers to invest in a broad range of assets, including stocks, bonds, and real estate, in order to minimize risk and achieve consistent returns. Embrace passive investing. The author argues that active investment strategies, which rely on stock picking and market timing, are unlikely to outperform passive investment strategies, which simply track the market as a whole. Maintain a long-term investment strategy. The book emphasizes the importance of maintaining a disciplined, long-term investment strategy and avoiding the temptation to try to time the market or make speculative investment decisions. Avoid debt. Debt can be a major obstacle to financial success. The author stresses the importance of avoiding debt and maintaining a disciplined approach to spending and saving. Focus on your investment goals. The book encourages readers to think carefully about their financial goals and to tailor their investment strategy accordingly. This might involve a mix of short-term and long-term investments, depending on individual needs and circumstances. Be patient. Investing is a long-term process and requires patience and discipline. The author encourages readers to avoid making impulsive investment decisions and to stay focused on their investment goals over the long term. These lessons provide a simple, effective approach to investing that can help individual investors build wealth, achieve financial independence, and achieve their financial goals over time. Don't try to beat the market. The author argues that trying to beat the market through stock picking or market timing is a futile exercise and that it's more effective to simply invest in low-cost index funds that track the overall market. Avoid emotional decisions. Emotional decision-making can be a major impediment to investment success. The author stresses the importance of avoiding emotional investment decisions and staying disciplined and focused on long-term goals. Keep your investment costs low. The book highlights the importance of keeping investment costs low, as high costs can eat into investment returns over time. By investing in low-cost index funds, individual investors can minimize investment costs and maximize returns. Avoid investment fads. The author cautions against chasing investment fads or trying to make speculative investment decisions based on short-term market trends. He encourages readers to focus on a disciplined, long-term investment strategy instead. Invest in what you understand. The author encourages individual investors to invest in assets and markets that they understand and to avoid speculative investments that they don't fully comprehend. This helps to minimize risk and promote investment success over the long term. These money lessons provide a clear, concise approach to investing that can help individual investors achieve their financial goals and build wealth over time.
By following these principles, individual investors can simplify the investing process and focus on what really matters, a disciplined, long-term investment strategy that delivers consistent returns over time. Here are some of the most famous quotes from The Little Book of Common Sense Investing. Successful investing takes time, discipline, and patience. No matter how great the talent or effort, some things just take time, you can't produce a baby in one month by getting nine women pregnant. The stock market is filled with individuals who know the price of everything, but the value of nothing. The four most dangerous words in investing are, this time it's different. Buy and hold a low-cost, broadly diversified portfolio of stocks and bonds, and your long-term results should be superior to those of the average investor. The less prudence with which others conduct their affairs, the greater the prudence with which we should conduct our own affairs. You get recessions, you have stock market declines. If you don't understand that's going to happen, then you're not ready, you won't do well in the markets. In investing, what is comfortable is rarely profitable. An investor who has all the answers doesn't even understand the questions. To the extent that you can look foolish, you're probably not taking enough risk. You only have to do a very few things right in your life so long as you don't do too many things wrong. These quotes capture the wisdom and insights of the author and provide valuable guidance for individual investors who are seeking to build wealth, achieve financial independence, and achieve their financial goals over time. Thank you for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe for more. For purchasing the book, the link is in the comment section for your convenience.